Hello YouTube, this is the Lego Team Formers channel. I am Zach. And I'm Daniel. And today we are going to be bringing you uh, another bonus premium episode from the movie series. And uh, today we're doing premium ratchet and premium brawl. So let's get started. Alright, so let's get started with some features on ratchet. So, some features on ratchet are the fact that, um, unlike our Dark of the Moon, he is a limish light green. And he is gray rather than like black and white. He still has the tire on the back, um, and he's got the red and blue ambulance lights. What is he? Is he a search and rescue ambulance? He's like, uh, yeah. 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 Sure. Um, so he has a bulky chest, and he's got like the, the sort of the tile piece, the green tile piece that sort of leads up to the bulky chest. Uh, one of the things that he's got is um, his shoulder pieces are uh, on the edge of the bar piece uh, that make up his shoulders um, because uh, we need the the normal shoulder piece um, to put the pieces that attach the, the lights so it actually goes the, the, sh the, the light pieces then the arms and then the shoulders uh, so they're a bit further out um, and then he uses a lot of lime green tile pieces and his legs, uh, they sort of, they sort of just flow together. At the bottom there, they've got a tile piece, um, and then a slanted tile piece that goes down on his leg. Uh, and then he's got the Autobot blue eyes and, um, the flat green tile piece that goes forward. And then I guess we'll go straight into weapons right now. So... He's got this right here, which is just... What is it, Daniel? Is it just a gun? Yeah, it's just a assault rifle gun. Okay. So he's got uh, That he uses in rifle. all three movies, so nothing special. Okay. Uh, and then the next one... Um, well, well it, we'll show you how to quickly attach it. So that's what it looks like. It just attaches like that. So, yeah. And then the next one is this... Um, are we doing the buzz saw? Yeah, in the movie, he has, like, a buzzsaw thing, um, and it attaches to his arm like this. So that's what that looks like. And then, I think that's it for Ratchet. Size comparison. So, we'll do a size comparison quickly with him and, I guess, Optus Prime. And the rest of the Autobots. Alright, so apparently we're doing the rest of the Autobots now. Okay, so these are all the premium Autobots. Daniel rebuilt them all. Um, so we have all the premium characters, including Jazz, who is tiny. But there. Um, so yeah, uh, that's pretty much it for Ratchet. So now let's move on to Brawl. Alright, so now we're going to do some features for putting in Brawl. Um, so Brawl is, he's like a sage green and gray in the movie, but we were low on sage green. Uh, but we tried to fit as much as we could. Uh, there's a lot from the back view. You can actually see a lot more. But from the front view, it's more of a lightish green, except on his chest and his hip. Um, so he has those sort of... What are they that are on his shoulders? Are they they're the, the, the treads? treads? Yeah. yeah, they're the treads that go over his shoulders. Um, and then he's got the big. Uh, they're like they're like Gatling gun turret. No, cans. they're the rocket launchers. Are they rocket launchers? So he's got big rocket launcher cannon things on his shoulders, and then he has like a lot of vents all over him. Uh, the top ones are meant to represent treads, and then. Um, yeah, I think that's it. And the legs. Yeah. What are those supposed to represent? The vents on the legs here. I don't know if he Yeah, those are also his other treads. Okay. Um and then he has extended arms which Okay, sorry about that guys. Um we the, the camera just dropped. Um so I think where we left off was extended arms. Um so the extended arms was um uh, he, uh, when we first did him, uh, a little while ago, uh, we couldn't use extended arms, uh, so they're really helpful now, um, they, they make it look a lot less awkward than it would have been, 
Um, you can probably just picture it right from there, how awkward it would have been if it just had ended at the green. Um, so yeah, I think that's up pretty much it for features. So Daniel will do your weapons for Brawl. Um, well, for starters, he has a, his Gatling gun, which is the exact same as Starscream's. And that just attaches right on the very back of his elbow, like that. And then he has his Gatling gun there. And then he also has on the other arm a double blade, which is just a binocular piece with two spikes in it, which attaches to his wrist like that there. So those are his weapons. Alright, so I guess we'll just do a quick size comparison with Barricade here. Uh, so that's what they look like. Um, Barricade's obviously a lot shorter, and then we'll do a quick one with Starscream. Uh, Starscream's hard to tell with studs, uh, which is why he's not really an ideal one, but these are the premium Decepticons that we've made. Um, so those are Barricade, Brawl, and premium Starscream. So that's it. Uh, thank you guys for watching. I think that pretty much wraps this up. Yeah. So thank you guys for watching. Uh, leave suggestions for whatever series we're doing at the time. I think it'll be still War for Cybertron because we plan on doing that for a while. So if it's War for Cybertron, then leave War for Cybertron suggestions in the comments section. Thank you guys. Bye.